What's going on YouTube? It's your boy Cool Cool Kids. We are back for another video guys and I am out doing raffles. I happen to be driving by Burbank to be honest. Like I wasn't gonna go way out of my way. But I happen to be in Burbank. They do have a raffle here. Let's go see the shoe palace and let's go get in that raffle as well. The mall is the Burbank Town Center. The only store they have here, I think the only single shop they have here is uh, Shoe Palace. But, and to be honest, it's probably not even worth coming here. But like I said, I happen to be driving by because I have to, have to do a little something for business. So yeah, let's go ahead and get in this raffle. Hey, this is the most people I've ever seen at this mall. This mall is usually always dead. That's what's up. All right, here's the shoe palace. Let's see what they got raffles. Oh, it's just the men's and GS sizes, I guess. White Oreo, AKA Tech Gray, Jordan 4s. All right, let's get in this raffle. Men's and GS, yep. All right, I did fill mine out. Haven't filled one of these out in a while. Man, all right. All right, let's check out the store too, since I'm here. Pretty, pretty decent shop. Pretty huge shop, to be honest. So they, that's the Jordan section. They don't show any of the Jordan 6 electric green, but they have it in that display. Oh, they also got the Flint 7s, okay. Size nine, that's what they got here. Not too bad, not too bad. I ended up keeping my size 10, to be honest. Then there's these as well, the Flint 7. Do got a mid and a couple of lows as well. This is one of the lower volume stores. You can usually find some good deals at some of the lower volume spots. Oh, well, let's see, let's see. I don't see too many sales tags quite yet. All right, these are definitely interesting. The one of the one stars. Who mentioned that? These used to be widely available at Target and stuff. They're so right. They have $30 for these. This is size six and a half. Then got these regular chucks. The gray ones. For some reason, the gray ones go on sale. $30 right here. They got plenty of sizes, men's. And then that looks like it's they only go by men's, but that's a size four, so kind of GS. We've seen these. All right, let's try it again. We've seen these Bape ones, $25 for these. Pretty good price. We've also seen these hot rod looking ones. American flag on the other side. What's this going for? Going for 20, 20 bucks, not too shabby. Not too shabby if that's your thing. I don't know, a little wild. And then got these cheetah looking ones. Going for 20, 20 bucks. Oh, they also got this piece one. They're looking for peace, seek peace, I don't know. 20 bucks though, 20 bucks. This is a size four. We did see some of these on sale at Northridge. The Reebok Classics, these are going for 40. I think these are normally 60, right? Normally 60. These are 35 right here. Oh wow, that's what's up. Anybody dying for Fila, $15 for these. Kind of the same look, kind of the same look. That's hilarious. These also going for 15 bucks as well. Not too bad, not too bad. I don't know, like leather's not the greatest, but it's $15. 15 freaking dollars, you guys. Also got these Fila's going for 15. And then the Disrupts, Disrupts. These are going for $10, 10 freaking dollars. What the hell, that's, that's what's the dope thing about these uh, low volume stores. They just don't have that much foot traffic. More stuff goes on sale. So definitely worth the, worth the visit, you guys. Wow. Do got these as well. What's up with their music? It's like going off and on. What the hell? Make sure do got these question lows. These are retail, buck twenty for these bad boys. These just came out. In the Nike section. Are these the monsters? Oh my goodness. These are dude. Wow, size of eight and a half. A buck thirty for these. Not too shabby. Alright, Hawachis. A little bit of a sale, hundred bucks. Normally what what are these normally? A buck ten or something? Buck twenty. Okay. PG's going for outlet like prices, 50 bucks for these. Digi Camo more for $50. And then these are watches down to 80. So they got some sales. Got some solid deals, you guys. Two got PG3s? Really? Wow. PG3s is going for $70 too. So yeah, $40 off. These came for what, what, 110, I think that's what they came out for. And got some deals, man. It's always fun. Checking out these low volume stores, seeing what they got. That might be one of the more interesting finds here. Y'all know I'm a huge fan of these size 11. Air more of tempos. And I think that's about it. Let's go to the next stop. Let's go to the next stop. All right, next stop, Glendale Galleria. I don't even think I've ever won anything at the Shoe Palace. 
to be really honest, I don't even know if this shoe palace is even worth it. But, um, but yeah, let's look around. I don't know, they have better restocks and stuff during the week. And I came, last time I came here, I came here on the weekend, so. They might have more interesting stuff. Let's look around, let's look around. Need to be quick though. Gotta go back to work. All right, I did check the counters. Nothing at the counters. Jordan section, kind of the usual PSG 7s, the Flint 7s. Don't see any restocks and I don't see any really, really nice sale items. All right, let's keep it moving, might be quick. Did walk across the street. There is a Nike retail store. They've been having heat. Not the last trip, but they've been having heat most of the times. I don't know, see if they got some interesting restocks. See what's up. In the last style section, they do have a six. Electric green six, that's dope. That's dope. Other than the sixes, not really much else. Couple of mids right there. Not much else. The women's section, they still do got these. Still got these, okay. Jordan ones, got that nylon. This leather is like amazing, dude. This leather is amazing. All right, that is an SE, I guess. All right. Dang, I'm doing all this walking and not much today. Not much, dude. Very good. All right, we're back at the Glendale Galleria. Not really finding much today, man. I'm not going to lie. Not really finding much. But, um, but yeah, at least that Burbank trip was actually really, really good. All right, let's go see Foot Locker. And, yeah, let's go see what's up. All right, do got Foot Locker. See what's going on here. We just came here, man. I, I'm not, I don't think I'm gonna find nothing. We'll see. Dang, they still do got the electric greens, electric green sixes. Man, those haven't been selling. Like, dang, dude. I know they don't have resale, but they're still dope. Size nine and a half, nine and a half. These toes so feel like the DMPs. Like the new buck, new buck feel is exactly the same as the DMP. The summer has begun and so have the sales on slides. Look at that, the Chinatown market ones. And look at this, $15. These are normally 60 bucks. Chinatown Market does have their trademark smiley face on it. $15, man. Yeah, that's a, that's a deal. I'm not into them, but I'm just saying that's cheap. That yellow one on sale as well. But dang, I guess those are the only ones on sale. Did they come out in the winter or something? What, what's going on here? Dang, they got more of the hoopery stuff. That's pretty dope. Part of their homegrown collection or their homegrown showcase. That's actually pretty, pretty sick. All right, nothing we didn't see last time, all right? Let's, let's go get in that raffle. Let's go get in the raffle. All right, just arrived to Sheep House, and look, they even got the panda dunks right there. Okay, okay. All right, I did get these. I gotta go, though. I gotta go to work, you guys. All right, so back to work. Lunch break's all done. Damn, I was moving so quick today, I forgot to show what I was wearing. And wear my new balance, you guys. These are my 574s. It's like corduroy material and suede. Huge fan of them. I did use my $10 off coupon. I did a survey and I think I had $10 off at Foot Locker Chance. Well, I forgot where. But yeah, these are freaking dope. 90, I think I got it for 80 after the coupon. And then I am on my lunch break, so jeans and a t-shirt. That's usually what I wear. All right, now we're officially done. Let's go home and let's talk about this, you guys. Let's talk about it. All right, guys, that was the vlog, you guys. That was from last week, and it was pretty quick. Um, I was kind of moving a little quick because I was desperate. I was desperate to get in those Shoe Palace raffles. I am not a fan of those in-store raffles. Um, just just because I, like, I can get people to hook me up with stuff, but I was desperate because I wasn't sure, um, you know, Flex had been tripping. Flex, I, I hadn't won on Flex in like a month. So, so I just didn't really know what to expect. I really didn't. And and I wasn't sure if my hookups were able to help me out. So I want that extra step. I, I, I did those in-store raffles. I don't like them. Just because the chances are small. I really do believe that most of the shoe palaces, uh, the, the raffles are legit. But there's just so many entries. Like, did you guys see that one in Glendale? Like, there were hundreds and hundreds and hundreds. Probably even like a thousand but yeah there were so many entries like the chances are super super small that's kind of why i don't like them just because like I, i've made connections and stuff now so um so i kind of do have uh people that can hook me up with stuff so um yeah but i i, I did go after these just because i didn't really know what to expect and i did end up with a couple so, so i was pretty happy the low volume stores if you really want some deals you might want to hit up some low volume stores just some 
like some of the sneaker shops in, in malls that are just dead or like ones that nobody knows of because because they do get some deals uh, they do liquidate stuff and and you definitely can't find some deals in those so uh, make sure you guys hit those up thanks so much for watching you guys definitely appreciate you guys make it to the end you know I am a huge fan of that thank you thank you thank you um, make sure you help your boy out. Make sure you press that like button. If you're new to the channel, go ahead, press that subscribe button. Click on that notification bell. I do drop a ton of videos. Should have another video coming out later today. So, uh, yeah, thanks so much for supporting the channel as usual, you guys. See you guys next one. Peace. Yeah.